Okay, I got this in the mail today. I have already opened it and I've looked at it and took it out of all the plastic. But there it is. It says Rambo. And this is John Rambo, the signature. Which, considering he's a fictional character, I don't know who signed that. <laughs> I guess Sylvester Stallone, maybe. This is a certificate of authenticity. It says Hollywood Collectibles Group and Flagship. And let's see here. This other piece of paper it says Certificate of Authenticity number 133 of 10,000 made. And I don't know how true any of this is, but. Well, here it is out of the sheath. You can see that it is, or at least it's supposed to be, 440 stainless steel. So this is a variant of the other ones that are in black. Can you see that signature right there on the blade? It says John Rambo, and then it says Flagship, the company that made it underneath. Got a pretty padded handle underneath this leather wrap. And it's got a little leather, cheap leather lanyard on there. It's full tang, goes through the whole handle. It's so no, it's not a quarter inch thick. It's probably, oh, I don't know, just a hair under a quarter inch thick. It doesn't say what the steel is, like on it anywhere. But I got this from China. It's more than likely a knockoff. I don't know. Because I don't know if it really is. It says it's officially licensed, so who knows. It comes with a half bearable leather sheath. Nice thick leather wilt in the center. Uh, kind of lighter bank line stitching. Not the, not the most heavy duty stitching, but not too bad. I mean, this definitely feels like it's real leather. It's got some weight to it. It's got this little lanyard so you can tie it to your leg. It's got a massive belt, belt loop on it so you could put like a four inch belt through there if even such a thing exists. But I got it just because that blade I'm a sucker for things that are shiny, I guess. And it's definitely shiny. The camera doesn't even want to focus on it. It says it has a 12 inch blade and it's 18 inches overall. There we go, camera, focus. But I can see myself in there filming this video. Let's see if it's sharp. I have already tested it. It's eh, it's paper cutting sharp, but it could be sharper. So here we go. Got a sheet of paper. And that wasn't too good. But yeah. Definitely, I mean, it'll cut paper. It's just, you could definitely use a sharpening though. To me, it looks like it's over 19 inches, and the blade starts right at the 12, so it's got a 12-inch blade. It weighs about, with the sheath, just over 2 pounds, so it's saying, and uh, without the sheath holding it in your hands, it's just a hair under 2 pounds. It feels heavier, though. Well, there you have it. If you want a massive uh, 
machete, a Rambo machete that has a mirror polish on it and a fairly sharp blade. And you like, it's too bad the sheath wasn't black because it would have went really good with the black handle, but whatever, it's pretty nice. I'm happy with it. Hope you enjoyed this video. This is Joe Doomsday, signing out.